Hello everyone and welcome to the third episode in this short little series covering the meta wish list for Planet Zoo after Oceana Pack. And today we're doing the Latin American continent, so Central America and South America merged into one here, just because the species do kind of overlap in that regard. And there are a few surprises in this selection, but um, let's just say I find loopholes in everything. So um, yeah, let's not waste any more time. And with that, let's get into the Latin American animals. First up is the South American Kawati at number three. And yeah, this is a species that I have wanted for a long time. It's not my most requested right now. The secretary bird has taken that spot, but I think it is second because I'm not really too familiar with wolverines personally, but South American Kawatis, though I haven't seen one in real life, I do know they are in Australian and Oceanian zoos as a whole. So um, yeah, this, is a, this will be a cool species. I, would, I look forward to seeing what kind of enrichment items they would have because we haven't gotten a new one for a long time. And some kind of arboreal enrichment items would be perfect for several of the animals in this selection. Next up is the Black Howler Monkey, a species that is the highest primate um, on the meta wish list. And yeah, they would be impressive to say the least, creating a great chorus across the zoos, much like the Siamangs, but a bit deeper. The Spectacle Bear at 10. The Joffroy Spider Monkey at, uh, at 11. Um, yeah, this species would be great to see a new kind of primate um, using the brachiation mechanic. Um, Golden Lion Tamarin at 15. The Greater Rhea at 16. The Ocelot at 18. The Southern Tamandua at 23. The Patagonian Mara at 26. The Collared Peccary at 29. The Roseate Spoonbill at 33. The Scarlet Ibis at 38. Common Squirrel Monkey at 50. The Southern Rockhopper Penguin at 52. The Bush Dog at 55. The Cotton Top Tamarin at 58. The Virginia Opossum at 69. The White Nosed Kawati at 70. The American Flamingo at 71. The Common Marmoset at 73. The Kinkajou at 74. Coyote at 75, the white-tailed deer at 93, the emperor tamarin at 96, the brown pelican at 97, burrowing owl at 108, oscillated turkey or was it oscillated? I really have no idea anymore. At 112, it does look a bit strange in the head though. The Brazilian porcupine at 115. The Azara Zaguti at 120. The Chacoan peccary at 123. The marine iguana, though not in captivity, would be a fantastic addition to see in the game if we were to get wild campaigns, as I've said, with several um, animals that aren't in captivity, just to spice up the roster a bit more to be to allow players to experience some of these animals in the game. The Southern Pudu at 128. The White-Faced Saki at 136. The, the black cap Squirrel Monkey at 138. This is the species of Squirrel Monkey I'm more familiar with, as they are the ones kept in Oceania. Common Squirrel Monkeys are more um, of America, Europe, and I think a bit of Asia too. But black caps are my squirrel monkey. The Guanaco at 146. The Great Blue Heron at 162. The Vicuña at 163. The Cuban Crocodile at 164. This is probably my second favorite crocodilian after the False Gariel in the last video um, because they, they gallop and when they gallop you know it. <laughs> they, they're just very cool and would love to see that in the game. Um, the giant armadillo kept in one zoo, I believe, in Brazil, but would be a great addition nonetheless. 
The South American Tapir at 172. It would be a good opportunity for Frontier to spice up their Tapir model and give us something that's a bit different to the other two. The Marsh Deer at 173. The Argentine Black and White Tigu at 178. They are large lizards and would be um, a qualified addition for habitat. They would be good in exhibit nonetheless. But um, yeah, I would love to see these guys as a habitat animal. Um, the Jaguar Rundi, a mysterious feline at 186. The Bald Uakari at 192. I think they're only at the LA Zoo, so Los Angeles Zoo, um, outside their native range. And yeah, I think that is the only one outside of South America that houses them. Um, the Black Cayman at 197. The Lowland Pucker at 202. The Southern Three Banded Armadillo at 204. The Six Banded Armadillo at 207. The Andean Flamingo at 208. And lastly, the Red Footed Tortoise at 209. So that is South America's um, selection, Central and South America's selections. There are a lot of primates in there. We are desperately lacking um, in New World primates. And from that list alone, there were several that could be chosen. Yeah, just so many. Howler monkeys, tamarins, spider monkeys, squirrel monkeys, marmosets, all that. And um, yeah, let me know what is your most requested South American animal out of either that selection or on your own. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.